Hello guys, good day to you. My name is Alvin. I'm very happy to be here to share with you some information and I hope you enjoy this wedding festival as well. Okay, you must be wondering what kind of information that I, uh, I will be sharing. Okay, uh, I believe, okay, maybe um, give you some hint. Okay, like take for example, uh, think through. When you are going to, a lot of people, when they are going to go through wedding, they will go and look for a master, you know, to go and, you know, uh, select an auspicious date to do for their wedding. Okay, so I guess you know what am I doing, okay? What is my occupation, okay? What is my vocation? Okay, without further ado, let's be share you all the PowerPoint slides. Okay. For well, today, I hope you guys have been, you know, uh, enjoying these uh, wedding festivals. And you must be wondering, wow, so many to choose. Uh, what, which one would be the best uh, promotion? Yeah, this is part of puzzle, okay, of choosing the right thing for your big day, you see. Okay, so I think you guys have been, you know, wondering, uh, already know, okay, not wondering, a good guess, okay. Uh, what am I doing? Yes, I'm a feng shui master, okay. I'm a principal consultant. Okay, and the founder of MZ Shen Feng Shui Mastery. Uh, my name is Alvin. Okay, uh, I have been in this field uh, is for 17 years. I started my consultation, okay, in 2005. And I started my academy to coach people who likes Chinese metaphysics in 2012. So uh, there are some people is already out. Okay, some of my students is already out been uh, up there. Okay, serving the public. Okay, so uh, till now today till today uh, I have seventeen years of experience. So yeah, that's me. Okay, so uh, definitely you must be wondering, hey, wedding, I'm every I can't relate. Okay, wedding. Okay, to feng shui, how does wedding? Okay, relate to feng shui. Okay, before we start the uh, sharing, okay, on the information, okay, let me show you, okay, what do my company do, okay, what is my company doing, and also what do I do, okay, so let's enjoy the video. If you are looking for the right place to learn and be guided by experienced teacher, master or mentor, this is the place to come. So I can feel it because if we are in the house, you will feel that the house is different. He will go through every month, one thing with Master Alvin, I know him through a referral. I have engaged him services like uh, Bazi and uh, my BPO flag selections. So actually, he also guide us through my career path. Like, for example, which career should I take, which is better for me, and when to apply for a job or when to go into the uh, industry. Okay, I started off with my Poker card divination. Recently, I also attended his uh, Feng Shui class. So actually, I benefited quite a, quite a lot. When there's any doubt I have, right? Sometimes I really use my what I've learned from the divination course, the Poker card divination course, and I actually apply and find some answers. Online for courses on Man Huai Ba Zi about two years ago, and I came across Jade Metaphysics Academy. San He Zhe Ri is a very good course, help us to choose an auspicious date and auspicious time to carry out important activities. Master Alvin is very approachable and very sincere and very humble. 
not only in class, but also outside class. That is why I have been attending courses after courses offered by J Metaphysics. Oh, okay. I believe you guys have been you know, watching this video and you, you know that what am I doing and what is my company doing? Okay. So you must, in, 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 during this video, I believe you guys have been heard hearing BTO selection, you know, feng shui for the new house. You know, you can't get away from new house because you're setting up a new journey with your loved one. Okay. So basically you need to feng shui your house as well. Okay. So this is part one of it and choose the right house and right, right uh, place for you guys, for the couple, okay, to live in. Okay, so feng shui. Okay, but beside that, okay, before I start to go in that, okay, I believe there is one common questions have been asked, okay, and been, you know, in wondering in your mind, okay, what is feng shui? Is it a science or is it a religion? Okay, I believe you guys, yeah, wondering, hey, what is feng shui? Really, it's a science of religion. Okay, the answer is, it's a science. Okay, why do I say that? Okay, let me explain to you. Sharing is caring, so I love to share a lot. Okay, come. You can't deny in the universe there's one big magnet called true north. And this magnet definitely will generate magnetic field because of the north-south pole. And this is where we have an environmental magnetic field. Okay, and how to prove that? Very simple. We have one thing called Zi Nan Zhen. What is Zi Nan Zhen? It's the compass. Okay, it will always point towards that. Okay, so that is why this is the, what we call the magnetic field. Okay, of the universe, what we call the environmental magnetic field. Okay, and next, you also will know that in our body, we also have magnetic field as well. Okay, that is, we can't deny it as well. This is science. Okay, this is how we, 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 we are interacting with that, with the environmental magnetic field. Okay, and also in our house. Okay, we also have magnetic field in our house. Okay, and it's detected by the facing and the sitting of a house and also the degree. Okay, what kind of energy, what kind of magnetic field is in the house? So definitely is science. Okay, we talk about magnetic field, magnetic field, magnetic field. So how is it's just a simple magnet theory. North Pole and South Pole, they connect. Okay, so let me call you an example. So when a North Pole and South Pole Okay, when it connects. So think through, if I find the right position for you, which is based on your magnetic field, okay, to be connected to the house, at the same time, you could be connected to the house, you sleep well, okay, you sleep well throughout the night. You wake up fresh, okay. So when you wake up fresh, what will you do? You'll be very cheerful, okay, very positive, okay. You, you look fresh. When you go to work, you can focus, okay. Definitely, you have more ideas when during a meeting, the boss will ask you for ideas. You have a brilliant idea coming up from you. Why? Because you're fresh. So you can sleep well. But if you are having a place, okay, your big position at the wrong place, okay, take for example, it's repelled. North Pole versus North Pole is repelling. You can't sleep well, having a bad dream always. And also when you wake up from the dream, bad dreams, okay, you can't go back to sleep. Okay, you see, you can't go back to sleep. Okay, and it has been for a few weeks. Can I ask you? Definitely, you will be at a low energy. Okay, you'll feel frustration. This one is part of it, frustration. And when you go to work, you can't focus. Okay, when you can't focus, okay, whenever people come and talk to you, you feel frustrated. So when you're frustrated, definitely you offended someone. When you are in the meeting, when the boss asks you something, your mind is blank. Okay, so can I ask you, will you get promoted? definitely will not get promoted. So this is all signs, okay? You sleep at the right position that can be connected to you, definitely you benefit from that, okay? So, so how to get the key of success? Actually, the universe magnetic field is more on the, what we call date selection, okay, date selection. 
Okay, and also the house is what we call the, we need to connect the house magnetic field as well. Okay, this selection is using that day magnetic field. Okay, and also not forgetting about calculating the human magnetic field. So to make it connected and to give you the key of success. Okay, so I believe a lot of people has been thinking, have been saying this in the Chinese, they say, 天使地理人和 I believe you guys heard about that. Okay, when a person promote, hey, right time, right place, okay, and right person. Okay, so meaning that 天使地理人和, this is how it comes from. The magnetic field has been connected to you to give you the beneficial stuff, okay, like promotion, you know, like, uh, you know, good things will be coming to you, okay, because it's connected. So, 天使地理人和, okay, so that is why, Okay, your parents have been uh, asking you to go for a good dick selection for your wedding as well. Okay, so now you understand, okay, why you need to go for a master, okay, to select a good date based on the human magnetic field, which is your date, or what we call the birth date, okay, plus your time. Okay, people call it ba zi, okay, in Chinese, or in other words, we call it four pillars. Okay, four pillars. In Caucasian, we, they call it called four pillars. Okay, so we need to analyze from that, then we give you the date, okay, to benefit you, okay, and make sure that that day of wedding is a smooth sailing, okay, smooth wedding, okay. So that is why 天使地理人和, and this is science. Okay, auspicious date. Okay, definitely auspicious date is the one. I think I believe you guys have been uh, looking to, to, to the masters, looking for masters to get the dates, okay, for, uh, you know, go go for Kuo Da Li. There's three dates for your wedding, okay. One is it, one of them is Kuo Da Li, okay, meaning that you give the gift to the, what we call the bright side, okay. The groom will give the gift, okay, to the bright side at the auspicious date and time. Okay, to go and teaching, you know, last time we have, we have the main pool, you know, we have the main pool, but now it's different. We are, uh, we, we go it together with the elderly, with the parents to go and teaching, you know. Uh, so, Ali is to make sure that when during the teaching part, okay, the day and the time will, uh, will definitely benefit you guys and make things smooth sailing and, you know, doing well. Okay, and not forgetting, An Chuang. The next one will be definitely An Chuang. Why I say that? Okay, for the groom, you need to answer, okay, before, okay, you can, uh, you, when you got married, the bride will be coming in and, you know, sleep on the same bed. Okay, so answer, there is a lot of things on answer. Okay, a lot of what we call sisu, or call customary, okay, things to do, okay, on answer. I believe you have been hearing, okay, I think you, uh, we have a lot of uh, those wedding shop, okay, they already sell you the package of how to, or like the, uh, inside this package on how to answang, like take for example, the package will have the uh, a red plate, okay, with the red dates, okay, with the peanuts, you know, or with the ang pao, with all zhao sheng gui zi, all this is, you know, zhao sheng gui zi, okay, so, you know, have all those views on the plate, okay, to make it auspicious, okay, for you guys to, you know, uh, to be easily conceived and, you know, zhao sheng gui zi, okay, Okay, to have a baby born uh far in a in a in a maybe a few months time. Oh no, not a few months time. You got conceived easily. Okay, so this is a very auspicious, you need auspicious date to do it, definitely. And for the big Antoine, you also need to take into consideration of the position okay, of the bed. Okay, this one because you guys will be sleeping there and the magnetic field will be reacting with you. So definitely you need to have the right position and the right position, we also need to use this lesson to know during the bait arrangement, whether that day and the time does it have any negative energy at the bait head around there, meaning that the position, okay, any negative energy there. So we'll normally for Feng Shui Master, we'll do it, okay, to, to, to when they are doing the uh, this lesson for the Antoine, the bait arrangement. 
Okay, so this you see, uh, there's a lot of things to talk, talk about the uh Anchuang. There will be what Hao Ming Po, we call it Hao Ming Po, which is uh but a, a lady that is uh with, with all with a ha good husband and doing very well, very prosperous, with also grandson, all this to come and help you to tell uh to while you are doing this, uh, what we call big arrangement, okay, with the big ship, all this, okay. That he she will be there, okay, beside you saying all those auspicious words. Okay, this is what, what we call customer. Okay, but in Feng Shui, we just need to know okay, where is the right position for the couple? Okay, and what is the good auspicious, auspicious date for you to position the big arrangement and for you to carry on with the customary stuff? Okay, so now you understand it's much more related. Okay, not forgetting the last one, which is the marriage of customary, which is the jia qu. Okay, jia qu is where you, the groom, Okay, you go for dog crash. Okay, you see dog crash, and your your the GMA will come and you know give you a good one. Okay, yeah, uh, yeah, give you a good one. So you let's enjoy it. Okay, the good one. Okay, so your brother will be yeah helping you to you know uh to 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 to, to enjoy together with you lah. Huh? So how? So basically, uh, you must have a this good day. Okay, good timing for you to uh you know go to the bride house. Okay, to bring him to your main house you do your the groom house oh so during this chi, we also need to consider the a lot of people definitely okay why we need to consider the pair both parents okay because you need to jing cha, okay you need to give offer a tea or ceremony or, or session to the uh, elderly or to your seniors and so that is why but we concentrate on the parents okay we concentrate on the parents so during this judge, we also do during the next selection, we also consider the parents' uh, uh, information as well. Okay, so that is why judge is also important. Okay, so you see, there is a lot of things that is related. Okay, during we want a very auspicious day to make sure that this whole uh, event, okay, the session of these three events is smoothly and is, is smoothly and uh, will be easily, uh, you know, get it done with a very smooth and success. Okay, so that is why auspicious date is there. Okay, so hopefully I answer and also give you some, uh, uh, some information and what is it related to feng shui, okay, somehow. But for the bed arrangement, it's just purely the position of the bed and also the, the, uh, we need to select the date, uh, make sure that there's no negative energy at that position. And for those, these two is more, more, more on the human, okay? The energy that, as I mentioned, yeah, the, the man, uh, human magnetic field related to the day, uh, auspicious date, the magnetic field, okay? We, we, are, we are more into that, okay? So that is auspicious day. Okay, definitely colors plays a part. Okay, if you want to know more uh, things about color, colors, colors, they have their own elements as well. Okay, like fire, red, orange, pink, okay, uh, red is the main, okay, orange, pink, all this, okay, even purple is fire element. For earth, you'll be beige and, you know, yellow, okay, will be that. For the metal, will be white and also the gray. And for the water, will be the black and the blue and not, uh, for the, this wood, it will be the green. Okay, so all elements is there. Okay, so now for uh definitely there will be uh, you know people asking, hey, what should I wear? Okay, uh, what are the auspicious color that I you must be uh present on that day of my big days? Then from there we will need to analyze. Okay, the day, okay, the day magnetic field versus your personal magnetic field. Okay, take for example for the the bride. Okay. Uh, what kind of colors will definitely benefit her better for the girl? Oh, then we will can, you know, we will give some ideas, okay, on what kind of accessories they can use, okay, from there. Okay, so this is more related to the colors as well, okay? So they have their own energy as well. Okay, but big arrangement, okay, that's mentioned. I think, I, I, I believe just now I already answered a lot of questions on the big uh. Uh, not answer. I have uh, asked tell you guys more on, on this big set, uh, arrangement. Okay, we focus on the direction of the bed head. Okay, the position and also the sitting of the bed, uh, the bed and also the energy at the day to for you. Okay, and the human. Okay, and for you guys to do this bed arrangement as well. Okay, make sure there's no negative energy at that place. 
Okay, so this is uh because this is the place that you will sleep. Okay, uh, sleep there. Okay, uh, for eight hours. So this is the place that you will energize. Okay, your energy. Okay, so it's very important. And also, not forgetting of conceive at the right position of the bed, your conceive rate will be higher. Okay, will be higher. Okay, why do I say that? Okay, because you need to have the right energy. Okay, you must have the right energy. Okay, at the right position, get connected. You rest well, definitely. You will have a positive energy while you know trying out for babies. Okay, so uh, normally though, uh, in feng shui, we will have a methods. Okay, uh, the and the calculation or even the formulas. Okay, to calculate. Okay, on which direction will be having a higher chance. Okay, to having a higher chance of conceiving. Okay, so if you have the right position of the bed, uh, for those who want to conceive, you will have a higher higher chance. Okay, so not forgetting the harmony. Okay, the harmony part will be uh, the we definitely want uh the couple to be good. Okay, uh, bai tao tao lao. Okay, okay. So that is why uh actually in feng shui we have a uh, we 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 know have some formulas on the harmony side. Okay, especially uh on the bed part. Okay, so for, for the big part and the stove, and for the baby, we also can use the stove, stove position as well. Okay, the boost and uh, the position to boost and make it easily to conceive. Okay, for the harmony part, also there is the right position. Definitely, you will not, you, you will be uh, more harmony and you, you guys will have a good communication and problem will be solved easily. Okay, together. Okay, so this is how okay, Feng Shui will help you in your wedding. Okay, so I hope you have a risk, you know, from here. I hope you enjoy this uh, wedding event. Okay, I hope I wish you guys a blissful wedding and hope you guys, uh, you know, have your good auspicious day, a good feng shui a house, okay, to, for uh, the new wet couple to stay in and definitely zhao sheng kui zi. Okay, so this is my contact. If you are, you are interested to find out more, okay, you can WhatsApp me or even email me, okay? So this is my email and contact. Okay, so that's all for, uh, that's all for today, okay, the information. I hope you guys have benefited, okay, from this sharing, okay? And if you guys have any question, feel free, feel free. You, you can, you have my contact. You just uh, WhatsApp me and ask more information. I will be happy to share with you. Okay, so uh, hope you guys enjoy and please take care during this period of time. And yeah, take care. Uh, Master Alvin, signing off.